All right, all right. Looks like we're live. BFit Nation, how are we doing today? Welcome back to another week of BFit Live, our workout Wednesday edition today. Um, grab your towels, grab your water bottles, grab everything that you need to feel comfortable and settle in. Uh, I'd like to introduce my guest, Senior Master Sergeant Sonia Berry. How are you, ma'am? Good morning, everybody. Doing well. How are you? Morning. Good morning. Yes, ma'am. There we are. I'm doing well. Thank you so much. And I'm, it looks like you're wearing pink as in my great segue into Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Uh, we, we encourage you, a gentle reminder, to get those wellness checks and, um, and, and, and things like that in for this month and moving forward for our health and wellness assessments here. So um, welcome back. If you're new to our BeFit Live workouts, we uh, program these workouts to, to incorporate as many muscle groups as possible within a short amount of time. So we're just under 30 minutes of our workouts uh, with a 40 second on 20 second of rest approach uh, when we'll complete four exercises with four rounds. Again, 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off, four exercises for today and one minute rest in between each round to complete a full body workout. So that will get us through our midweek push. Uh, now's the time to, to brace, brace down and buckle down and, and, and push forward through our week. Uh, we'll, we'll hit um, some dynamic stretching before our workout starts uh, just to get our minds and our bodies prepared and moving and um, ready to work here. So I'll go through the exercises. I'll do some mock-up demonstrations of each exercise. So that way, when we get to that exercise, you already know what's about to happen, okay? So our first exercise is going to be a split squat. Now, we've, we've been here before. So split squat, if you have resistance, if you have dumbbells, if you have access to anything with the handle, uh, go ahead and grab that if you feel comfortable and use that as resistance. But we're going to do 20 seconds left leg, 20 seconds right leg. So left leg, and we are at that split stance here for that split squat, and we're just going to lunge down like this, 20 seconds, okay? We're going to feel all of that uh, power and isolation in that forward foot, that forward leg here. So 20 seconds left. Alternate 20 seconds right. That's going to be exercise number one. Exercise number two is going to be alternating reverse lunge with a three roll pull. Okay, so we are going to come to the top of the mat. We are going to extend back here. And if we have any weight here, if not, we want to make that fist as tight as possible. And we are going to row one, two, three. A couple of cues here. Your chest is going to be over your quad, over your knee, but you want to sustain and keep looking forward here with that nice neutral uh, spine here. So, okay, one, two, three, back to the top, alternate left leg back, right leg forward, one, two, three, or that reverse lunge, three rep pull. Okay, that's exercise number two. Number three, we have a half kneeling shoulder press. Again, we're trying to work out uh, as many groups as possible here. Our left foot is forward, our right leg is down, and if our right leg is down, our right hand is pushing. So we're, we're doing a half kneel shoulder press. Number three, that's gonna be 20 seconds left leg, 20 seconds right leg. Okay, a couple of cues here just to keep that core nice and tight, nice and engaged and uh, engage those glutes as well as focusing on that isolation for your shoulder press here. Okay, and number four, we're gonna do some plank variations here. So exercise number four, we're gonna go down into a plank on our elbows for our first round. Our second round, we'll move into a side plank, okay? That's gonna be right side. Third round will be left side. Well, so we'll go down on our left hand. And um, our fourth round for a plank variation, we'll go back to that uh, forward stance on that plank, okay? So that's one, two, three, and four. I hope we are ready to go. I hope you're ready to roll. Grab mats if you need for that plank variation and to half kneel uh, to absorb some of that weight and make yourself as comfortable as possible while pushing through these workouts. All right, let's go ahead and towel off, grab some water, and we will move into some dynamic stretching here. 
All right, I hope we're doing well today. All right, let's move into some dynamic stretching here because it is important to get our minds and our bodies nice and prepared, nice and primed for this workout ready to go. So let's go with dynamic stretching is up first, okay? We're gonna grab that left leg. We're gonna reach up top and extend that right hand all the way up above our heads here. Nice long stretch. And we're gonna alternate right leg goes back, grab it with your right hand, left hand all the way up, touching the sky here. Nice long movements here. And let's go to your pace and to your comfort here. Go ahead and push those hips forward. You can feel that stretch in the psoas, feel that stretch in your hip flexors right there, along with extending just a little bit higher than the last time. We're going to move through these dynamic stretches for about 20 to 30 seconds each. So we can go ahead and move at our own pace here. Nice dynamic quad stretch. Okay, let's move into some reverse lunges reaches. All right, up to the top of the mat. Right leg is going all the way back here. We're gonna reverse lunge. Hands go up, clasping together here, and we are going to reach over to our left. Back to the top, left leg extends all the way back. Hands together, and we reach over to our right. Again, to our comfort level here, to our pace. Really working on scanning that body here. Looking to see where we're tight. Looking to see where we need to pay a little bit more attention. And feel that stretch in your back, in your lats. Again, hip flexors, if you've been sitting for a long period of time, I know I have. So these stretches really help out to open up those hips. Get them nice and loose here. Again, two more reps here for me. One more to go here and we'll move into some fixed feet lateral lunges here. Feet stance, nice and wide here. And we are going to just lean. Lateral lunge here, nice and comfortable. Nothing too aggressive here. We're just working on getting some blood flow to our lower body here. You can feel the stretch through those inner thighs, that inner leg. Nice and smooth here. Three, two, one. Nice. Now we do have some planks coming up later on. So let's move into some walkouts here. We're gonna stand shoulder width apart to the back of our mat, if you will. Hands reach down to the toes. Slowly walk out to a high plank position. Pause for one second and return back to start. This time come all the way up, really squeezing those glutes up top. Nice stretch all the way down, touch your toes, extending out to a high plank position. Hold that plank for a pause, keeping that core nice and tight and returning to the top vertebrae by vertebrae, extending again. Nice, nice, nice. There we go. Feeling that stretch in the hamstrings. Again, in your hips up top, glutes. Embracing your core. Nice and tight here. Last one here. Nice and smooth to your comfort level and stand nice and tall back up top. Let's move into some hinge reaches here because we do have some back posterior work to do. So let's reach up top here. We're gonna hinge at the hips, nice 45 degree angle and back to start, which is nice and tall, okay? Hinge at the hips, nice soft bend at the knees, feet are shoulder width apart, hands are nice and tall above your head. You should feel that stretch in your shoulders your lower back, squeeze at the top with your glute activation. Nice, nice, keep those shoulders engaged. Hands are nice and tall. Three more reps here, two, one. Okay, YTW, some of my favorite dynamic stretch for 
really engaging my shoulder mobility here. That's what we're really working on here. Hands together here. We're going to reach all the way up to that Y position, extending nice and long back to center, reaching all the way out to that T, back to center, and a nice tall, proud chest here for that W, squeezing those shoulder blades together. See two more sets of these Y, back to center, reaching all the way out to that T. Again, you should feel that squeeze in your shoulder blades. Nice, tall, proud movement here with that W, showing off those biceps. One more round here, Y. All right, extending all the way out to that T. Shoulders are nice and loose. You can feel that blood flow moving to our muscles. That W, all right, good to go. All right, I hope you're ready to work. Let's towel off again. Let's get some water. Let's stay hydrated today during the workout. I'm gonna set my timer and we will be ready to work here. BFit Nation, how are we doing? Go ahead and leave us a comment. We'd love to know where you are watching from, where you are working out from. Are you indoors like Sergeant Barry? Are you outdoors like myself? Let us know. Let us know where you're watching from. All right, we have split squats, 20 seconds left leg, 20 seconds right leg in 10. Left leg is forward, right leg is back. Let's go ahead and learn the movements first this round, and then we'll go ahead and up it. Left leg forward, right leg back, and let's lunge here. There we go, we should feel that isolation and power through, drive through the heel here. All the way up left leg, you should feel that contraction in your left quad, squeeze up top with your right leg up in your glute. 20 seconds in, let's alternate here, right leg forward, left leg back. Let's continue. Our hands can be on your hips, hands can be down by your side. Seven more seconds of work here. Nice, push through. Feel that burn there. All right, and let's rest here. Alternating lunge, 20, 10 more seconds of rest here. And we'll move into an alternating lunge with a three rep row in five, left legs forward, right leg extends all the way back in two, one, here we go. Right legs all the way back, chest above our quad, above our knee, three reps in, back to the top. It's a nice long extension all the way back, three reps to squeeze those shoulder blades together. Take your time with this. This one will catch up to you. Full posterior chain work here so we can feel a lot of strength, a lot of power being driven from our heel up to our glute, all the way up to our back and squeezing on that three rep row. Two, one, and time. Good work, good work. Let's drop one of those resistance here. We're gonna go into a half knee shoulder press. Left leg is forward, left leg is up. Right leg is down in five, four, three, two, one. All right, let's work. 20 seconds each leg here. Let's focus on keeping that core engaged. Really working on stability here, on balance and control. Two, one. Okay, let's alternate here. Left leg goes down, right leg goes up, left arm goes up, and we are pushing here. Again, half knee shoulder press. Eight more seconds of work here. What's great about taking any exercise down to the knee, it takes away that body <laughs> and zero. All right, time to rest here. It takes away and eliminates but any body sway that you may encounter doing a workout. So if you wanna challenge yourself and isolate yourself a little bit more, let's move into planks in five. Go ahead and drop down to that knee. Three, two, one. All right, 40 seconds of work here. We have planks on deck. Again, these are a nice, this is a nice form of working that core stability here. Planks on the elbows. 
Again, we wanna work on keeping our core nice and tight, nice and engaged. Retract that navel to the spine. And speaking of spine, keep that spine nice and long. Your back should be flat. 10 more seconds of work here. Are you shaking? <laughs> yes. yes. Yes, I am too. Five, four, three, two, push it out. And time. Good work. Awesome work. Awesome work. First round's done. First round, we learned it, team. Let's towel off. Grab that water. Mm. All right. First round, we learned it. Second round, we are going to own it. Split squats are on deck, not just yet. But we have one minute rest in between each round. If you're just joining us, welcome to Be Fit Live. Four exercises, four rounds, 40 seconds on, 20 seconds of rest, keeping that heart rate elevated, burning those additional calories for an aerobic state here. So seven seconds here, let's load up split squats in five, four, three, two, left legs forward, right legs back, and we're working here. All right, there we go. Let's make sure and extend all the way to the top here. Keeping that head nice and neutral. Three, two, one. We're alternating right legs forward, left leg is back. And we are squatting here. Again, focusing on our balance, our core stability, keeping our core nice and tight, nice and engaged, powering through our heels, driving up, feeling that extension through our quad. Three, two, one, and time. Good work, good work. Those aren't easy. Those will catch up to you. I'll try to reverse <laughs> lunge. <laughs> All right, eight more seconds of rest here. Let's load up, up to the top of your mat. We're extending with our right leg back in three, two, one. Let's go alternating. Extend all the way back. Three reps of a row. Return to the top of the mat. Left leg's back. Two, three rows. Top of the mat here. Extending all the way back. Nice. Again, if we don't have any weight, let's go ahead and clench those fists nice and tight and really accentuate that top of the movement on your row. Squeezing those shoulder blades together, nice and tight, nice and controlled. You can feel those lats working. Two, one, and time. Awesome work, awesome work. Again, 15 seconds of rest here. I'm gonna grab one weight for resistance. All right, five more seconds of work. My left knee is down, my right leg is up. Weight is in my left hand and I'm pushing here for 20 seconds. Left arm, 20 seconds. Keeping that core nice and tight, nice and engaged. Trying not to sway here. Really isolating that shoulder press. When you come down to comfort level, let's alternate. Left leg is up, right leg is down. And we are pushing with our left shoulder here. 10 more seconds of work here. Try and come down nice and controlled. Right about a 40, 90 degree angle here. Two, one, and time. Good work, good work, awesome work here. Way to finish off. We go down here. As soon as you say, you said, don't swear, I almost fell over. <laughs> <laughs> All right, second round here. We're going to go into that side plank here. Side plank. Your shoulder is down. Right leg is right leg. Right shoulder is down. We're on our right side here. Let's make sure that our elbow is directly underneath our shoulder for the most stability here. We keep that core nice and tight, nice and engaged. Try and make a relatively straight line here. Try not to dip. Try not to raise up too much. 10 more seconds of work here. Nice and tight, nice and controlled. Squeeze that core. 
squeeze those glutes. Three, two, one, and time. All right. So let's really focus on our obliques here. So you should feel it on that lower oblique facing towards the ground. <laughs> good stuff, good stuff, BFIT Nation, good work. Two rounds down, we are halfway through. Grab some water, let's keep it rolling. 30 seconds of rest to go. And we'll move back to the top of the workout. How are we doing? Are you pushing through? Are you pushing through BFIT Nation? <laughs> All right, 20 seconds to go here. Again, thanks for joining us on this Workout Wednesday edition. We are starting in five, four split squats, three, two, left leg is forward, right leg is back, my weight is racked, and I'm working here. Left leg is working for 20 seconds, and then we'll alternate to our right leg. Nice and controlled. At your pace here, again, driving up through that left heel, up to that quad, and your right leg should just be extending all the way up for support. 20 seconds are down. Let's go ahead and alternate. Again, right leg is forward, left leg is back. Keep that core nice and tight. Your back should be nice and long here, nice and flat. Five more seconds of work. Keep pushing, it's burning. Three, two, one and time 20 seconds of rest you've earned it three rounds in already time flies when you're having fun <laughs> here we go alternating reverse lunge with a three rep row in three two one top of the mat and we're working here one two three up to the top here extending back nice and long two, three, there we go. Bringing those shoulder blades together, squeezing that posterior chain. Got an extra one in for good measure. Again, let's keep that head nice and neutral. Our back is flat. Keep that chest up. And let's work on our breathing as well. Two, one, and time. Good job, good job. Dropping one weight, keeping one on us. And we're down for a half knee shoulder press. In five, your left leg is up, right leg is down. And we're pushing here through our shoulders, driving that power, feeling that contraction in that shoulder. Nice. This is a great isolation movement for our shoulders with the bonus of core stability. In two, we're alternating. One, here we go. Alternate here. Right leg is up, left leg is down. Good work. 10 more seconds of work here. This is a, a great movement just to isolate your shoulder strength. Two, one, good work. There we go, there we go. Round three, last round, last round. Last exercise of round three, rather. I didn't mean to fool you. We're coming down to that side plank. Right leg, right arm was down left time. Let's go into our left and we're up. We're working here. Left arm is down on our side for the side plank variation here. Again, you should feel the burn, not only everywhere, but specifically in that oblique, that left side down to the ground here. 17 more seconds of work here. Keep that core nice and tight. Chest is up, glutes are firing, core is firing. Let's keep it up. Five, four, three, two, squeeze, one. And time, good work, good work. <laughs> awesome job. Awesome way to finish off round three. <laughs> Uncomfortable. 
Can I just stay here? Yes. For 40 seconds, you can stay there. 40 <laughs> seconds, you can stay there. Go ahead and reset your body and our minds. And let's get ready to finish off this last round. Nice and strong here. Again, if it doesn't challenge us, it doesn't change us. And I know we like to be challenged. Together though, 15 more seconds of rest here and we'll move into our split squats. Left leg is forward, right leg is back in 10. <laughs> All right, let's get ready to work in three, two, one. All right, let's go down here to your comfort. Last round, best round. This is a great time if you wanna scale up, go ahead and add some additional weight here to your comfort level. Drop that right knee down to your comfort level. We're all tightening in three, two, one. Let's switch. Right leg is forward, left leg is back. Nice. Y'all are looking good. <laughs> nice and controlled here. Five more seconds, four. Drive it through, three, one, and time. Go ahead and take that 20 seconds. You've earned it. I'm gonna hang on to my resistance for that alternating reverse lunge. Here we go, top of the mat. Grab that weight in three, two, one. That's the work here, big step back. Drive those elbows back, shoulder blades back for that three rep row. One, two, three, nice and controlled. Nice and smooth here. One, two, three. Again, making sure that our chest is above our quad, above our knee. Speaking of knee, should be tracking right at our toes. 10 more seconds of work here. Go ahead and pick up the pace if you can. Nice. Four, three, two, one. Finish it out, nice. Nice work, nice work here. How are we doing, we push it through, eight seconds. Left legs down, left legs up, right legs down, left hand, left or right arms ready to go. Hit three, two, one, <laughs> here we go. I promise, I know left and right. Seven seconds of work here <laughs> with our right hand, with our right shoulder. Two, one, <coughs> let's go ahead and alternate. Left hand is up, right leg is up. We're pressing. Here we go. Nice, if you scaled up, keep pushing. If you scaled down, keep pushing. Three, two, one, nice. There we go, 20 seconds of rest here. That goes by fast. We're gonna move into that normal plank position here. Let's go back to the start. In five, four, we're on our elbows. Three, two, one. Here we go here, 40 seconds of work. Let's finish out strong. If you need a little bit more stability here, go ahead and open up that foot stance. Open up that stance there for some more stability. The closer your feet are, the tougher it's gonna be. All right, 20 seconds of work here. 20 seconds to go. Keep that core tight. Again, your gaze should be right at the fingertips here. Nice and neutral. Back is flat. The glutes are fired in eight, seven, six. Finish off strong. Three, two, one, and time. Nice work. Nice work, nice work. There we go. As quickly as it comes, it leaves us. Such a great workout. Again, these are some of my most favorite exercises here. We get to dial in our full body here. We get to really build on power and strength through our total body rather than just isolating one muscle group. 
in a short amount of time here. So as you can see, it doesn't take a lot of space for us to accomplish these workouts. Give us a high five, give us a hand clap. Let us know in the comments what you enjoyed the most, what challenged you the most. Let us know. <laughs> Good work, Sergeant Barry, how are you doing today? Yeah, great, Roy. I really love the progression with each workout. And you weren't kidding with this one. I definitely felt it. Um, whole body workout. So definitely challenging, but rewarding. It's good. Yes, ma'am. What's great about these workouts that if you, uh, if you feel the need to want additional workouts, go ahead and take a look at our Facebook page where we've cataloged all of these workouts under the Be Fit channel. And not every workout is the same. Every workout has been totally different in some way or another. So if you want to experiment, if you want to add different movements to your regimen, not just Wednesday, but if you want to tackle a Thursday, a Friday, a Saturday, a Sunday, whatever day that's convenient and whatever time that's convenient for you, go ahead and check out the other previous workouts and you'll find that everyone is different. So you're able to isolate different muscle groups. You're able to challenge yourself that much more. So uh, we welcome you <laughs> to continue to watch and to continue to push through. So again, this has been a great workout. Thank you for joining us, BFIT Nation. I hope you enjoyed it as much as myself, as much as Sergeant Barry has. I know she's pushed me as, uh, as, <laughs> as much as I've pushed her. So thank you for staying strong. Uh, stay safe, stay fit, and stay ready. We'll see you next week. We will be back on Monday at 11 a.m. Central Standard Time. We look forward to seeing you. We look forward to working out with you. And uh, we're signing off here. Uh, Be Fit Live. Be Fit Nation out. <laughs>